hate Sundays. They're always so quiet. That sounds like Mrs. Wilson screaming. Maybe she's watching a great horror movie on TV. Get rid of those creatures. I'm trying, Martha. I'm trying. Hi, Mrs. Wilson. Can we watch the movie, too? What's the matter, Mr. Wilson? Your vacuum cleaner break? I'm not trying to clean the floor. I'm trying to catch mice. Looks like a direct hit to me. That does it. I'm going to the Mitchells, and I won't be back until you're rid of those mice. <laughs> oh, this is all your fault, Dennis. The day you brought your mice collection over and they got loose. We can help you, Mr. Wilson. Yeah, we're good at catching things with our bare hands. Watch this. <laughs> Don't you mean the mice? Never mind. I'll catch them my own way. Poor Mr. Wilson. I've got it. Come on, let's go to my house. Your mouse troubles are over, Mr. Wilson. What's that thing? It's the world's greatest mouse trap. Watch! Ah, oh, this is wonderful. I can't believe it worked. I feel just like one of the Wright brothers. Which one? Orville, I think. I hate saying goodbye. <laughs> So let's just say, good riddance. Here, boys. Here's a quarter for each mouse you caught. Wow, a whole dollar and a half. If we catch some more, do we get the same deal? Certainly. But there's not a mouse left in the house. <laughs> oh, no. What's that? Fellas, I think we're going to be rich. They think it's a carnival ride. Wow, looks like our trap caught about 15 more, Mr. Wilson. That's another $3.75 you owe us. No more, Mr. Nice Guy. This time I'm taking no prisoners. It won't be long now. The poor little mice. What are we going to do? Quiet. I'm thinking. I got it. What did you do, PB? You'll see. Bingo! That's the answer. And if that doesn't work, I'll call for an airstrike. We'll get rid of them this time, Mr. Wilson. What a great idea. You're going to show them home movies and bore them to death? No, it's even better than that. Watch! It's a holograph. It looks like it's there, but it isn't. Amazing. Simply amazing. That'll be another $4.75. Here, help yourself. Got every last one of them, Martha. I certainly hope so. You won't be needing these anymore, Mr. Wilson. Meow! <laughs> Where to find me? Oh, no! <laughs> and 
Dorothy was never so happy to see her aunt and uncle and be back home in Kansas. The end. <sighs> That's a neat story. I know. Now go right to sleep. That's right, we're munchies and our cookie crop is in little pieces. Sorry, that's the way the cookie crumbles. A comedian, too. Can you tell me how to get back home? Looks to me like you brought your home with you. <gasps> but if you want to get home, you'd better follow the yellow banana road to the city of Odd and ask the wizard. He'll know. Okay, thanks a lot. Ah, watch out, <laughs> this is very... <sighs> Slippery. Wow, look at that! A field full of marshmallows! Hey, cut that out! Shoo! Scat! Hi, what are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm a scaredy cat. I'm supposed to scare all these pesky marshmallow mice. Beat it! Scat! You don't seem to be doing such a great job. That's because I don't have any brains. See? They forgot to give me any. Who's they? How should I know? I told you I've got no brains. Gee, maybe the wizard could help you. We're on our way to see him right now. Do you think so? That sounds great. Let's go. You're supposed to get down from there first. <laughs> You're right. Well, if I had any brains, I would have thought of that too. Timber! Look out! Whoa! Okay, who did that? I did. What about it? That wasn't very nice. You could have hurt somebody. Uh, yeah, I know, but who cares? You see, I haven't got a heart. Now I understand. I think. Then you'd better come along with us. We're going to check out this wizard guy. Maybe he'll have a heart. No kidding. I always wanted one. Lead the way. It looks kind of scary. Ooh. Ha! <laughs> I scared you. Oh, yeah? Fool yourself. Oh, help. Help. Don't hurt me. I didn't mean it. What's the big idea, anyway? I'm supposed to be a fierce, scary lion, but the only one who ever gets scared is me. Big deal. Come on, Tin Kid. Have a heart. I wish I did. Why not come with us to see the wizard? Maybe he can make you brave. That's a great idea. How come I never think of stuff like that? Because you've got no brain, dummy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Could we get going, then? This place is scary, especially when it gets dark. Mmm. Something sure smells good around here. It's this castle. It's made of gingerbread. <laughs> Could we stop here for dinner? I'm hungry. Good idea, Scaredy Cat. It was? Well, what do you know? Here, there's plenty for all of us. Mm-hmm, good. Pass me some more. All right. Who's the wise guy? Hi, what's cooking? Gingerbread, that's what. And you brats are eating me out of house and home. I'm sorry. It's just that we're so hungry. Nobody eats my castle and gets away with it. You're in big trouble. Turn around. Ooh, 
Bruno's got us. <laughs> Get us, hey! Oh, 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 oh. So, thought you could escape, did you? Gingerbread men, seize them! Hey, let go! Let go! I'm getting tired of this game. When can we go home? Never! Here you are and here you'll stay, you little ginger snap nappers! But my folks will worry if I'm not home by bedtime. They're worrying already. <laughs> Look! Mom! Dad! I'm coming! My folks are on TV! Dennis! Dennis, where are you? Forget it, brat. You're not going anywhere. You big meanie. Ah! Quick, let's get out of here. That was very brave of you. Show how come I'm running. <laughs> Sorry for her? Nah, I just hate to see all that gingerbread go to waste. I wonder if we'll ever find that wizard. Hey, look! That's Odd! What is? The place where the wizard lives. It's called Odd. Let's go! That's weird. It looks a lot like Mr. Wilson's house. And that looks like his garage. <gasps> Maybe we should come back later, like in a hundred years. <gasps> Can't you see I'm busy? What do you want? We're looking for the wizard. He's supposed to be very smart. Oh, well, that's different. I'm the wizard. I'll be with you as soon as I finish welding my spell-testing power rod. There, all finished. Now to test it out. Oh, why me? Oh, wow, a brain. I can feel it. Two and two is four, and E equals MC squared. <gasps> I'm smart. But you're also boring. <laughs> a heart. I finally have a heart. Say, you're cute. What about him? Do you have any spare bravery laying around? Plenty! Where'd he go? Boo! Whoa! Mr. Wilson! It was you all along! Yes, well, I suppose now you want to go home. You bet I do. Oh, next door to <laughs> me. Yeah! Oh, all right. I'll send you home on one condition. What's that? From now on, you have to stay out of my hair. That'll be easy. You don't have any hair. Quiet! What? Rough. It's only lightning. Don't be scared. Dennis, we heard a noise. Are you all right? I am now that I'm back home again. Back home again? Yeah, me and Ruff barely got away from that mean witch and her gingerbread soldiers and those little munchies in the cookie field. Cookie field, right. I'm sure it was very exciting, dear. Now go back to sleep. <sighs> Good night, Mom. Good night, Dad. Kids, what wild imaginations they have. Munch, 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 munch. I 
Tony's supposed to get a bath, not us. And I thought a dog is a boy's best friend. Oh, no, not again. Oh, dear. Gracious, look what you've done to my precious Fifi. Her hairdo is ruined. Sorry about that, lady. I'll pay you boys a dollar if you'll give her a shampoo. Lady, you got yourself a deal. Wonderful. I'll be back in an hour. Hey, guys, this gives me an idea. We're going into the dog washing business. A dollar to wash Brutus? Sounds like a bargain to me. Thanks, mister. He'll be done in an hour. Make sure you wash behind his ears. I hope we don't run out of soap. Now be sure not to use water that's too hot. Don't worry. He can't shrink anymore. Uh, a little to the left. Now a little to the right. Perfect. Great. Now we don't have any bath water. How are we going to wash all these dogs? <laughs> Exactly what is going on here? Hi, Mr. Wilson. We've started a dog washing service. <laughs> Look at my car! Now I'll have to take it down to the car wash to be cleaned. That gives me a great idea. Let's take the dogs down to the car wash and get them washed at the same time as the car. How do we get them there? You'll see. Hello, Harry. I'm going to ride through today and check for leaks. <laughs> Yeah, this is worse than a bath. And I thought my mom scrubbed hard. It's kind of peaceful in here. What? Shoo! Skin! Get off my car! Hi, Mr. Wilson. Oh, huh? it sure is wet out there. Dennis, get these mutts out of here! Sure, Mr. Wilson. Out you go, Poochies. Whoa! Close the doors! <laughs> Where did you ever get a crazy idea like this? We've got you to thank for it, Mr. Wilson. Yeah, thanks, Mr. Wilson. No! Oh, don't mention it. They all look kind of happy that they had a bath. They're just glad it's over. Oh, my little Fifi. You look so clean and healthy. That's because we gave her some exercise, too. You boys did a wonderful job. Here's an extra dollar. Thank you, ma'am. Hi, where's Brutus? I don't know. He was here a minute ago. Uh-oh. <laughs> Easy, Brutus. Oh, no. Again. Does that mean you're going to take it back to the car wash? I'll have to. Great. Come on. Let's go find some more dogs. No. Dennis, no. I'll change my 